Hello! In this video we're going to look at how to install the IceBlock keyboard layout in Adobe Premiere using a Mac. First thing you'll want to do is go to the IceBlock resources page and find the IceBlock keyboard layout for Premiere. Click on the found here and it will take you over to this page where you can download it. The download will happen very quickly and as soon as it's finished it will open up automatically but you need to go over to your downloads folder. The first thing you have to do is remove the txt extension from this file. And it will ask you if you're sure. Yes, you want to use KYS. All right, we're halfway there. Now the nice thing about keyboard layouts in Premiere is that you can load them while the software is open. So here we are in Premiere. We go over to keyboard shortcuts. And if you look, we have ice block A. This is the um, configuration we usually use and nothing else. We'll cancel out of that. And now all we have to do is drag and drop this into a folder. But what folder? Let me show you. It's in your documents, Adobe, Premiere Pro, 8.0, the user profile, subfolder Mac. And then in there you will have your keyboard layouts. Very easy, drag and drop. And when we go back into Premiere, all you have to do is go to Keyboard Shortcuts and ta-da, there it is. Choose that layout. This layout is based on the keyboard layout from Final Cut 7 with a couple small changes here and there. The biggest one being that the U key automatically drops footage from your source window into your timeline. This makes for very, very efficient in, out, and insert when you're um, loading footage for the first time. Click OK and you're good to go. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck!